Hello, my fellow Americans, on this horribly patriotic day of the super Tuesday. That's how much I cared about it. I don't know. I'm very put off by the whole two-party political system in general. And, uh, to combat that, no, not even to combat that, to because I still wanted to vote for somebody that I was wanting to vote for. I voted. And, uh, I don't know. It was very strange. This is the first time I voted in Tennessee. And, uh, and actually, I think I voted absentee all the other times I voted in Illinois. So, this was the first time I'd ever gone in and punched a ballot. And, of course, I'm not really voting. I'm uh, helping to support a nomination for someone that has been nominated so that someone can nominate them and then make them the official nominee. Does that situation sound familiar to any of my coworkers? But anyways, um, went and uh, voted. And uh, I don't know. I was looking forward to punching a card, to making a Chad disappear, to obliterating Chads. And uh, apparently Williamson County, being the uh, rich motherland that it is has the electronic voting and so basically it was like I was taking a uh, a poll on MySpace or on uh, something like that so it wasn't as satisfying as it could have possibly been but I don't know it was weird you stand in line and you present them with your driver's license and or voter registration card which I not for sure my voter registration card is because I got it over a year ago and Take some effort for me to keep something that long handy. I think I know where it is, though. I think it's with all my... No, where is that? No, I got that in 06. Wow, that's been a while. But anyways, um, I voted. Let's see, you get in line, and you hand them your driver's license, and you have to fill out a form, and then you have to tell them whether you're voting Democrat or Republican. Which, I'm, you know, I, that's okay, I guess, if you're telling somebody, but... I'm not a big fan of the lady who gave me the form going whenever I check the box that I checked. But, you know, that's kind of weird that that's not real secretive, but I don't know. I prefer to not vote for a particular party. I'd rather vote for people I want to be government officials, not dependent upon their party. But I guess since it is a primary, you kind of have to choose a side because there's all those delegates and whatnot. Hopefully, in the real election, in November, I can vote for whoever I wish for. If not, I'm really going to be bothered. But, um, anyways, and then I went and you got to get your little ballot number recorded. And then, uh, they take you over to the, I was hoping there'd be a voting booth. My glasses are fogging up. There's no voting booth, even. There's just a, um, um, freestanding kiosk. A freestanding voting kiosk that, uh, with a touch screen. And you push buttons and however it is nice the fact that I missed voting for three of the delegates from the the Senate I think have three delegates that vote and uh, or something like that and I missed voting for them and it said hey wait you've not filled out everything you could have filled out and it sent me back so that's at least nice that it's less easier to make a mistake so that's good so, anyways, all in all, it was a good voting experience, my first Tennessee voting experience, and uh, maybe I'll try it out again in about nine months. I don't know. We'll see. But that's pretty much it. Hopefully, uh, if you feel strongly about somebody, you'll vote. If you're just apathetic and don't care, don't, don't even vote, because you're just going to taint the results. But, um, I don't know. We get to vote even though there's a big political machine acting everywhere and keeping the man down and all that kind of stuff. Or is it the man keeping him? I don't know. Somebody's getting kept down, but it's it's still free in the sense that there's at least a choice somewhere. And somebody has a say in a greater republic sort of way than uh, other places. So hopefully you too can possess one of these fancy stickers. What should I put this on?
I don't know what to put this on. But, uh, oh well. Anyways, hopefully you too can possess one of these fancy stickers because you voted, or at least nominated someone so that they can be nominated by a uh, person who nominates people so that they can be a nominee. But that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you have not. I am hungry. I'm going to go get some food, and then I've got to go buy um, some Valentine's Day giftesses. So that's me and my day off, which I have a lot of this week. Ugh. Anyways, thanks for watching.